What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Cozy coming at y'all with another video, man. Hey, man, if y'all see these stripes on me, this is not a part of the jacket. This is just the blinds or the lights, you know, from the sun shining. What's good, y'all? How y'all boys feeling, man? Yes, it is indeed been a long couple weeks since I posted, man. I've been in the field. I've been doing that, man. Running that operations. Glad to be out the field. You feel me? So I can shoot content, man. Like I said, one of the biggest things I'm excited for is to shoot content. Feel me? I do appreciate everybody who been liking, commenting, and subscribing and showing love. And like I said, yes, you know what I'm saying? I'm growing, you know, you know, you know, step by step, inch by inch. But man, hey man, if you watching this video right now, if you watching this video right now, share it, man. Share the content, man. You know what I'm saying? Cause it, I, I'm telling y'all, man, it's gonna get bigger, it's gonna get bigger and bigger and bigger. I'm trying to say, I'm trying to put you down, you feel me? So one thing I do wanna say is man, if you are new watching the channel now, man. Hit that like, comment, and subscribe button, you feel me? Turn on them post notifications, you feel me? Uh, if you like the content, man, comment. You feel me? Comment. Interact with me, you know what I'm saying? I be wanting to interact with people, you feel me? But as y'all can see by the title and thumbnail, man, today we are doing a Q&A. But, yeah, man, like I said, I just want to give y'all a little Q&A. Just to give y'all a little tap into my life, you feel me? And just kind of, you know what I'm saying, let y'all know who I am. And then, like I said, as I grow, y'all will see more and more and more of who I am, you feel me? So, let's get straight into the video, man. Question number one, man. Question number one is, and if y'all don't know, man, I'm reading them off my phone, you feel me? So, question number one. Question number one is, when the Hellcat coming? Man, if you know me, you've been watching my content since I, I restarted back in last November. I've been talking about the Hellcat for forever. And the Hellcat that I'm gonna get is obviously a challenger. Like, yes, I have a scat pack right now, and you know what I'm saying, it's a charger, but I, I gotta go channeling, like, that's just been one of my dream cars just growing up, like, for me, like, and, you know, once I get my Hellcat, I'll tell that story, so be on the lookout for that, like, I'll tell y'all the story on why I really wanted to challenge you, but, yeah, man, my next car gonna be a Hellcat Challenger, the only thing I'm just trying to figure out is, is it gonna be a Red Eye, or is it gonna be a regular Hellcat, but either way, it look true, you feel me, and I ain't gonna lie, like, y'all might be like, damn, you probably, you know what I'm saying, I'm getting it just because I always wanted one, and don't be, and like don't get me wrong, like I'm a, I'm gonna do like a little bit of speeding in it, but you know what I'm saying? I don't race, you feel me? Like I do this shit cause I'm cozy. Yeah, I got a scat pack, and I'm a transfer. I'm a convert to a Hellcat real soon, man. Like I said, right now I'm just, I've been just trying to find deals, and you know what I'm saying? I've been on the market looking for them, but I'm just trying to find the right one for me, you feel me? So then I can go crazy in that, you feel me? So Hellcat coming soon, man. Y'all, hey, y'all, hey, hey. If you're watching that, you better keep watching, man. I'm trying to tell you. Turn this YouTube shit up for me, you feel me? Stay tuned. So, question number two, man. You thought about streaming videos or reaction videos? So, um, streaming, no, not really. I do watch streams, like I watch Kostinad, Bruce Drop Them Off, DDG, and sometimes Speed. You know what I'm saying? I do watch streamers, Ada Raw sometimes. I do watch streamers, but I haven't thought about streaming. Like, right now, my only goal is to just be consistent on YouTube and blow up on YouTube. Me. And that's why I need y'all to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Subscribing gets me in the algorithm, you feel me? And more people get to, you know, watch my content and it'll blow me up, you feel me? But, you know, I know great things take time. And I gotta provide good content for y'all in order for y'all to share it, clip it, and, you know, spread it to your friends. One day I might do streaming, I don't know, man. But right now, streaming ain't been on my mind. Reaction videos, so. Same thing as streaming, like so you can stream and do reaction videos, you feel me? I have thought about doing reaction videos, but you know, I just haven't, you know, just tapped into that element yet, just because I'm just trying to grow, like do my vlog and shit, because I feel like my lifestyle is interesting, and I want people to see me come up, and people don't know, man, and I'm just gonna go ahead and answer this too, because people might not know what I do, right? So, I am in the military, right? So, okay, so people don't understand why I do this vlog and shit, right? So I do this vlog and shit because for one, not to be funny, like, I didn't have a lot what I had now growing up, you feel me? So I want to show people that it's possible to get this shit. Cause I, I know if I go home, a lot of people are still trying to find their way. They not tapped in. They not on the level that I'm on. And God be the glory, you feel me? I know niggas ain't on my wave, and niggas ain't thinking how I think. And nigga, like, and like, I'm gonna turn this shit up on a different level, you feel me? And that's why I do YouTube. And also, I want to show people that like, when you get out of the military, you know what I'm saying? There's a better way of life, or there's another way of life, you feel me? Because I know a lot of people who get out the military. They go back to their mama couch, like they be like back to 
square one, basically, you feel me? So I'm trying to show y'all that, yeah, I'm, I'm military, and I do that shit, but you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna pop it on this YouTube shit, you know what I'm saying? Kinda like on my Duke Dennis shit, it's like, while I'm in the military, I'm gonna be growing my YouTube, so when I get out, my YouTube will be flourished. And streaming and reaction videos, that might come in the near future, but right now, my, my main priority is vlogging and showing y'all the lifestyle. And another thing that I wanna say is, without saying too much, man, don't matter what age you start, man, just go ahead and get to it, man. Any motion is better than no motion, you feel me, so. So, question number three. Do you need a cameraman? To answer that question, yes, I do. So, yes, uh, I do like to, you know what I'm saying, I vlog myself and all that stuff, you know what I'm saying, but I do feel like if I had a cameraman, you know what I'm saying, it'd be more easier, you know what I'm saying, I could just be like, cut the camera on right quick, and not even on no action, like, cut the camera on, hey, let's, let's get, cause like I said, I be having people around me that's funny, that's lucrative, that's crazy. My mom always tell me like, you got a goofy side. People don't never get to see that. They people want to see that. My brother tell me that too. Like, man, bring me to just be you, which I always, which I always am. But you know what I'm saying? When I'm on like on the camera, I'm more always, I'm always serious. You feel me? I'm not really always jokey jokey. So like, I feel like if I had a cameraman, you know, it'd be better they could just record certain moments that I don't get to show y'all. I definitely need a cameraman. So if you are serious about being my cameraman, DM me. My Instagram is in the description below, so if you are serious about being a cameraman for me, DM me, you feel me? And we'll, we'll talk business, you feel me? But I definitely need a cameraman. Cameraman coming soon, man. And like I said, that's just what I want to do for my content, you feel me? Like I said, the channel is growing, but I feel like I can pop it on a different level and, you know, show it more, man. So, cameraman coming soon. I'm gonna stop Y'all be on the lookout. Question number four. So, they say, are you going to dress up for Halloween? Or or why not? And if and, and if you are, what are you gonna be? So spoiler, I'm not gonna lie. So, um, for, I, so I usually don't dress up for Halloween because I ain't celebrated Halloween since I was young. I ain't gonna lie. Like Halloween just like another day to me. Well, it's really for the kids. How I feel like you know what I'm saying. I might go to a Halloween party or something, but like celebrate Halloween. I, I never really celebrate Halloween. Like it's, it's like well, when I was young, I did, but now growing up, that's that's out the window. But yeah. So to answer that question, so yeah, with my friend B. You know what I'm saying? She loves Halloween. And, you know, Halloween is like the fucking best holiday to her. You feel me? So, I'll be celebrating Halloween with her and my dog Ash. Shout out to them. And, um, to give it away, my uh, outfit is going to be AJ. So, we're going to be Timmy Turner. Well, we're going to do the Timmy Turner theme, you know what I'm saying? And the SpongeBob Dirty Dan thing. So, I'm going to play AJ. And then I think, I, I think I'm playing Painhead Larry, if I'm not mistaken. So, yeah, man, so like I said, I ain't celebrated Halloween in a long time, but this Halloween, I'd be that, you know what I'm saying? Just because my dog celebrate Halloween, and I'm gonna celebrate with my dog, so. Yeah, man, so. All right, so question number five, man. Question number five is shopping spree or clothing haul? So, I don't know if that's really a question or a video they wanna see, but I'm gonna do both, you feel me? Like, if y'all wanna see a clothing haul, well, I could do a, I could do a shopping spree, then show y'all the clothing haul, or the shopping spree, you feel me? Cause I don't say, I ain't gonna say I shop all the time, but when I do shop, I buy by the pieces just cause I'm trying to get into this fashion room, you feel me? Like I'm trying to get my fashion game up, you feel me? So if y'all do want to see a clothing haul or a shopping spree video, drop it in the comments below and don't DM me. I, I, I ain't gonna lie, like, I mean, I appreciate people who DM me, bro, but if you watch the video, comment on the video. Like, that's the whole purpose of me uploading on YouTube so you can comment on the video. Because you might say something that people are scared to say. Like, and y'all, you might be like, oh, wait, what you mean? But, like, if you want to see, if you want to see me do a clothing haul video, drop in my comments on YouTube, not in my DMs, on YouTube, and hey, drop a clothing haul video. Because then people might like that. And I might be like, oh, shit, okay, that's what people want to see. So, all right, I'm going to do a, a shopping spree or a clothing haul video. You know what I'm saying? Like, my thing is, like, yes, I do content for me. You know what I'm saying? To put out, push out to y'all, but I also want to do what y'all want to see too. You feel me? Like, that's the whole purpose of interaction. But, you know, that I do appreciate what I get though. I'm very grateful. Question number six. So, question is, um, what what motivated you to go crazy with the YouTube shit? So, what motivated me, man? I'm not gonna lie, man. So, DDG is one, but I didn't really get into DDG until I was like, I already in YouTube. And that was kind of like around, cause I really, cause I said, if anybody know, I started in, if I'm not mistaken, 2020. And I was, you know what I'm saying? What really made me do it was a guy named uh, Kevin Edwards. And if you, and it's one of those things, like if you know, you know. He used to do skits, vlogs, and everything. And I used to remember watching how he came up, you know what I'm saying? Where he, you know, he had, where his wife was just his baby mom and he only had Jayden. But 
Yeah, you know I mean, I used to watch Cameron Edwards, and he very motivational just because, like, you know what I'm saying? He, he really showed me, like, five years of a dedicated grind can change your life. Like, like I said, he was struggling, like, trying to, he was working, as a, uh, working at security. He used to work at a fitness center and everything. He's just trying to find his way. And now I look at him, you know what I'm saying? He's a multi-millionaire. He got 10 million, 10 million, um, 10 million followers or subscribers on his gaming channel. You know what I'm saying? Do real estate, buy exotic car. You know what I'm saying? Like he changed life in five years, so that was very, very, very motivational to me. Then once I started to get into the YouTube, now then that's when I started watching the DDGs and uh, um, the flights and the Cash Nasties and all of them, man. You know what I'm saying? That's what inspired me to go crazy with YouTube. And even with the YouTubers I watch now, like Quan, Cashy B, Dub, Shaq, uh, Kasanat, you know what I'm saying? Duke Dennis and all of them, like. I just watch certain tree body, free tree body, you feel me? But it's just a lot of YouTubers that I watch because they motivate me. One thing I learned is like, everything don't happen overnight, man. And it's like, you got it or you don't, but you just got to put that grind in, you know what I'm saying? Pay off in time, you feel me? And one thing I noticed is like, it's a bunch of YouTubers out here, man. But that's what motivated me, you know what I'm saying, to go crazy with YouTube shit, man. Because I know, man, if you keep grinding, you keep dedicating, you keep putting in their face, man, people going to have no choice but to gravitate you gravitate towards you and you have to put out good content you know so you gotta put out content that people can relate to because if you know me the biggest thing i keep saying is youtube is the new cable you feel me like people don't really got cable no more they be on netflix hulu hbo stars youtube you feel me so i just want to be that channel that people can grow with and people be like damn man i remember when cozy was mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying and now he you know what i'm saying so that's what motivated me to go crazy with YouTube shit, man. So I'm gonna definitely keep trying to go crazy, keep throwing out content, and not just any content, but keep trying to keep throwing out good content and go from there. You feel me? Next question. So, what's your next card? So, my next card is what I said earlier, the Hellcat, man. Like, I might be like, oh, he ain't made no progress, but you know, I just been patiently waiting. You know what I'm saying? Because great things come to those who wait. Because one of the, one thing I do want to say is. I've been inquiring about them, and I've honestly found some some great cars. I'm not gonna just do anything to just get that car. You feel me? Like I gotta make sure it's right, and you know what I'm saying it fits my my budget and my stuff that I got going on. You feel me? It fits around my lifestyle, so that's the only reason I haven't got it yet. But just know I'm still looking. I'm gonna get one. I'm gonna get a Hellcat soon. Challenge. Next question. So it said, who do you look up to as far as fashion, man? So I'm gonna get y'all two lists. I'm gonna get y'all people that's in IRL in real life. And then I'm gonna give y'all the people that, you know what I'm saying, I don't know. So I'm gonna give y'all the people that I don't know firstly, just because like these might sound like familiar names. But number one, I'm not gonna lie, uh, Yachty, DDG, Offset, Kasanak, Quan, you know what I'm saying, Cashy B, uh, Clarence NYC, he be putting that shit on. And you know what I'm saying, uh, a couple local people that I see on Instagram, but like I be on HBO Fits and shit, so I be looking at people fits. So. You know what I'm saying? They be going crazy on there. They be having some dope. Some people be having dope fits. Oh, even Hollywood Shack. Got to gotta start Hollywood Shack. Hollywood Shack been putting that shit on lately. So those are my, you know what I'm saying? People that I don't know, like influencers. You know what I'm saying? I look up to as far as flashing. But in real life, got to give a shout out to my dog Free. My dog Free be putting that shit on. Like I said, he really be putting that shit on. So shout out to my dog Free. Shout out to my dog Manny. He be putting that shit on. Shout out to Red, Kai. Shiner, all my dogs, you feel me? Like, they be putting that shit on, you feel me? Shout out to Knox. So I look at them and I look at the floor and I'm like, all right, I see y'all. See the guys putting the shit on, you feel me? And I can't forget too, even though I just met her, shout out to Tati. She be putting that shit on too. She be having some hard fish, you feel me? So, yeah, that's why I look up to as far as fashion. Like, they be putting that shit on, you know what I'm saying? I be getting inspired, like, all right, I need to start piecing shit like this, you know what I'm saying? Cause like, I have clothes, as you can like see in the background, I have the pieces. I just gotta learn how to put that shit together to make that shit flourish, you feel me? And which I'm getting into, so. Y'all see, man. Y'all see, man. Alright, so another question, man. So, where did you get the name Cozy from? So, I really got inspired from ASAP Rocky. Like, you know what I'm saying? They're like, I'm gonna get the, I'm gonna get the tattoo, too, but the whole AUG, you know what I'm saying? Like, that little wave. I want, I'm gonna bring that back for sure. I'm gonna bring that back. I'm gonna find, I'm gonna find ways to recreate that because like that's just what I'm on, like that type of time, like, like yeah, like and you'll see it, man. You'll see it. Like I said, I don't want to say too much about saying nothing, but yeah, y'all will see it, man. But yeah, man, ASAP Rocky is the reason why I came up with my name because Carter is my last name. You feel me? 
but you know what I'm saying? I put cozy boy because like I'm co I feel like I'm cozy, like and I'm I'm elevating into that lifestyle. You feel me? Like you know what I'm saying? And, you know what I'm saying? Co I just feel like cozy, just a laid back young nigga who doing his thing. You know what I'm saying? He creates an influence, and that's what's going on. You feel me? Like I just feel like. Me personally, like, I'm creating my own little wave, you know what I'm saying? I just can't wait to bring it on a higher level to where people be like, they have no choice but to see it. Rocky, like, like to me, sometimes, like, no matter what Rocky put on, that should be hard. And I just remember, like, in 2018 when, you know what I'm saying, I was watching him go up to round two and, you know what I'm saying, popping it with, you know what I'm saying, Ian Connor with the Ben Storms and, you know what I'm saying, he'll wear, like, a Prada bag. And, like, hey, A$AP like, Rocky is the reason why I call myself cool. Just know, man. And then the whole ASAP mob, they play a collective role. Then you got, then you got the people that's sort of like that's into it too, like the Uzi, the Cardis, and all that, man. So that's where I got the name Cozy Book Carter from. If anybody's ever wondering, because like I said, I call myself Cozy just because like I like that name. You feel me? People can call me Carter, you know what I'm saying? Oh, Cozy Book Carter, whatever. But like I said, I like Cozy because like, it's like yeah, nigga, like, you're embodying him type shit. So also, man, I don't even know. I almost forgot, man. But shout out to my dog Cat Scotty, man. My dog Cat Scotty be also putting that shit on, man. And if you seeing this, bro, shout out to you, man. You just dropped your project, Cash, man. And y'all go stream that, man. I put the link down below, man. But Cash, that shit hard, man. It's a five-song project. Shit going crazy, you feel me? So y'all go stream that, man. You watching that? Go stream that right now. So, man, I hope y'all enjoyed this video, man. I, I definitely enjoyed recording this for y'all, putting this out, man. My first Q and A. If y'all want to see more videos like this, man, drop in the comments and be like, let's do another q &A. If we can get this video to 100 views in 24 hours, then I'll do another q &A in the future. Man. And this time I have more and better questions, you feel me? But if we can get this to 100 views in 24 hours, I'll do another q &A for y'all, man. Like I said, not like back to back, but I definitely keep that in mind and I'll do another q &A for y'all. And my next time it might be a mukbang, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? Might have a special guest, you know, you never know, man. And like I said, but I'm gonna make it very entertaining for y'all, man. And if you're new to the channel, man, please watch, comment, like the video, you feel me? And if you're fucking with my content, subscribe, you feel me? You know, subscribe ain't nothing but pressing the button, you feel me? So if, you, if you're new to my channel, just like, watch, comment, and subscribe, man. And if you are a real Q and viewer, then I definitely appreciate you, gang, for tuning in and watching your boy, you feel me? Your boy is on the road to 1K. 1k subscribers you feel me so like i said man pass these videos to a friend man recommend me share them the whole time man like i said when i go up y'all going up mark my words i do a giveaway you know what i'm saying so y'all just push the content give me to a thousand subscribers and we out hey okay